once again, ladies, gentlemen, and non-binaries out there, I am Lord Teamaker, and this is more PC backlog streaming. Yes, as we continue, we continue Chroma Squad 2. Now, it was only a couple of hours ago when we finished, but this is a lot of fun. A great time, a barrel of laughs. in a bigger studio. We're all going to go bigger studio. <laughs> Can we afford this? Yes. <laughs> Crafty Rebel. <laughs> hey Crafty Rebel. Remember me? He gave me a card after you helped me on the train station. The guy who needed money for tickets says his card didn't work. I seem to have brought your bags along with me by, by accident. Train companies, right? So sorry about that, but it took intact. It's looks only broke though, so if you can send me some money to mail it back to you, um, maybe a little extra for a cab. <laughs> Hey, no need to be like that, okay? Here's your money back. I won't bother you anymore. <laughs> yeah. What if I can't be trusted? Well, just stay alert. <laughs> right. I would advise you differently. A bit of worse advice. <laughs> <clears throat> advice. Good luck to you. you. <laughs> or is it a devil ministry? <laughs> Enlarge your sword, eh? Well. Hello, hello. Would you be interested in buying a great uh, upgrade to your sword? Some people might say it's kind of thing as a scam, but who knows, right? Again, let's give Mook that because, again, she can... She can use that more than us. <clears throat> because she has assault. Okay. 
her fan favourites. There we go. Can't do anything with Mecha yet. So we have game, plus 20 audience and team acrobatic vote, team attack. Reach target distance to your target when you attack. Ooh. Now keep that sniper cap. Heal all allies up to four. Yes, keep that. 20% plus dodge. Ooh. Michael Patterson needs to gain his fans. I think we're ready to record. Just in time. A real world threat looms over something very dear to our heroes. When I stop in time, keep all your heroes standing, defeat 10 enemies. Season, we should introduce more dramatic episodes, otherwise, the orders may get tired or even bored. We should make them even more realistic. That way, friends, our new script has got it covered. Today was supposed to be a standard day in their heroes' lives, but with great power comes great responsibility. Yes, Spider Man. I'm pretty sure I've heard that line in a movie. <laughs> Let the narrator do the talking Michael Pats and get in position. What will Shearers do without trouble lurking about? Monsters appear because of reasons. Looks like they're after us. Phew, we found you. The whole crew will be here in no time, Kroger Squad. You know where to run. I'm pretty sure I had them distracted on our way here, Crafty Rebel. <clears throat> More? Today is going to be a good day. Get them! Our heroes must have survived the attack of these minions that came out of nowhere. Wait a second. Why are the real time chroma key special effects? I'm planning to add some cool computer effects to see later on. For now, use your imagination! Should have been gone.
<laughs> Hello Pixel, how you doing man? Yeah, this 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 music is awesome. This game is fucking hilarious, man, I tell you. For some reason I pressed it twice again. that button instead. Boom! Well, powers unleash! <laughs> now goes it, dude. Like you've read decent spirits, so that's good to hear. Oh, what are you playing later on? So, what's this about? <laughs> Abduction. Tell me more. Oh, the switch was just to miss. Oh, okay. It's a very, very puzzly. Ah, oh, I must go. we go after. Right, let's move, move Mook over to here. Lovely. Yeah, this game, Chroma Squad, uh, very much based on Power Rangers.
Yeah, children of zodiacs. I was thinking that earlier as well. Kill one of those fuckers off. Try, let's try and get them gone as well, because the shooter ones are pricks. Keep all your hit her stand and defeat ten enemies, we did it! Attack us! Back in just a few now, why is dead? Well, we did destroy that traffic light guy a few days ago. <laughs> meep, 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 meep. A message from, from Cerberus in danger to Cerberus chambers now! <laughs> Meanwhile, in Cerberus chambers. I will never have your way, villains. I've won from a squad of your presents. From a squad, you arrived just in time. <laughs> Whoa, what is happening in here? <laughs> they tracked our mecha and were able to find our hideout. They want to destroy everything. I don't know where the voice is going. It's going every fucking way. Get ready! <laughs> Never has learned to lie, it is not in danger to record the attacks. We're surrounded. Let's see if we're going to survive through this. Let your souls burn bright, cute promo squad. Are our heroes ready for such a problem with race? <laughs> now it's over the rate to so funny. Defeat four enemies in the same turn. Doing corn, you're right.
Lovely. See, I'm hoping to get more done tonight with this. Oh, <laughs> lovely. Oh, here comes a finisher on this one. Take this bugger out quickly and dispatch the others. Oh, Mook's not going to like that. Bastards! <laughs> I mean, to be fair, <laughs> we do have Boob's Power Unleashed. Five turns, good. Good job, everyone. We've got some great footage there. There's the deal. Tubby will join the scene. <laughs> and we should blast it off for a finishing move. Escalating the fights is against the hero code, Mook. My friends won't be happy. We have a lot of footage already. We'll edit the boss at the very end. Let's get going. To the scene, Tubby! <laughs> no, 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 not like that. Come on, you're in a secret hideout. Don't get jumping like that. Sorry, I'll try it a different way. <laughs> Alright, get on stage again, Tubby. There we go. Yeah, that's the way we like it. Let's try you all, then serve her right after. And then again, and again. Minions! Minions! Okay, uh... I believe I missed a shot to kill them off, that one off. <laughs> Multi shots! Oh, 
lost. That's right. I was going to say that. <laughs> Attack! Try and get him surrounded. Okay. Heroes by chance, Crabber Squad. Congratulations, little job well done. Without you, I would have been turned off for good. Or even worse, they could have managed to reprogram me to side as evil. I'll never do that. We have a world to save. We need you by our side. But, Subro, how did they track your mech up? Probably the nature of our mech's components. I believe there's still a chance for them to break him once again. Well, I'm Michael, very much, in case of, you know, being on the side of caution. We must remain vigilant, and crow the squad one more thing. Yes, sir, bro. Could you clean up the me this mess, since I can't really do anything about it? Carlos, boot powers unleash amazing finishing moves. <laughs> boot powers unleash a route. Kids are showing it. They're activated, they're activated. Good. Uh, I can't craft that yet, I can't craft that yet. Uh, studio, let's see what we can do with the studio. Upgrade the camera. <laughs> Decent green screen. <laughs> Lamps would pray.
shop can we get as well? Uh... Go. Whatever we can craft. Elegant grub, grub, grubs. <laughs> Might as well record. Keep some money by. Right, so we've got a choice of three now again. Real evil with legal trouble. Choosing to face the evil Dr. Soup. Dr. Soup even in court was the right thing to do. But Ludovic's Productions didn't expect he had some legal trips, tricks up his sleeve. At least that thing will be recorded. Uh, defeat Boss Monster, a finishing move, defeat enemies in Soup Turn. We have for the Horde. <laughs> there is trouble brewing at the construction site. Apparently a massive amount of zombies are living there. We have standing, the people for enemies in the same turn. Or monster portals. In this episode, Chromus Chroma Squad must face some mysterious monster portals. And by the way, putting an episode under the sun doesn't sound like a great idea when the temperatures are high, does it? Okay, let's do a real evil then. It's been over half hour already. The stuff everyone apparently Doctor Soap wasn't bluffing. He did go to court. How rude! <laughs> I guess something Ribbon would say. He wrote on Face Album <laughs> we're a carbon copy of his studio, which is so lame. He doesn't know anything about our show and just wants easy money. That'd be a good idea to record it, so I'm bringing, the, I'm bringing cameras like a documentary or something. I must see the judge in a few moments, so we might want to get going. Based on distance, we can just walk there. Alright, right on, let's move. Dr. Soap is the director, a naughty one as well. It's walked too longer than I expected. I got my calculation, calculation, calculations wrong. <laughs> too bad you had to sell your car, Samuel Chuffart. Let's just make a run for it. The building's right over there. <laughs> Hello, fellow. Wait a second. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, I have so many names. <laughs> and we don't know a single one. Call me Jay Moodson. Behold, as I send you out a sheep amongst the wolves. Wait, what? Who are the wolves? Me and some of my friends. Up. <laughs> hey, uh, this is crazier in the middle of the street. He worked for Dr. Soap. Show a common employer. Actually, think of this as a special episode for both of our shows. <laughs> Glad I brought cameras in. This looks way more fun than court. You're such a bully, Jay Milton, just like Dr. Soap. I've been looking into this for far too long. Stop bullying people because you can't do anything good by yourself. Let them do their great things. Whoa, I'm not sure who you are, but I definitely like you. So we meet again, Awakened Dragon. The Champion of Justice is back and I've trained much more than ever before. Definitely my favourite sin. This bully needs to be stopped right now. Awaken Dragon. What a cool guy. Jane Milton, prepare yourself. Okay, three enemies, same turn. Got a Michael?
Yeah. <laughs> Take this. This game is so good. It's so much fun, I tell you. Boom! Powers on each! Try and get Mr. Twatty in here. Again. Now you'll have to face me in my true form. So it's true, the devil has many faces. You need to take care of this by yourself, Scroll Squad. Now I must leave to my Japanese class. I can't let my students wait. <laughs> Thank you, Awakened Dragon. 
Good luck, Grammar Smart. Now it's time for our mech up. Luniverse! Off the power of ten tigers here. This could be so good with a little budget. Jonas <laughs> Frost said type on. Ah, there's a podcast about us. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Holy cow, Chromus Squad is so awesome. It's the old hero show nostalgia just right in right, the right spot. Part-time accountant, a friend of your dad's. Indie marketing gig. We mm, can do that. Let's do this. Great justice. <laughs> Hello, Chroma Squad. My name is Edward, and I'm a huge fan of your show. It's always a highlight of the week when I get to sit down with my daughter, Ariana, and watch your show. The adventures that you have and the stories you tell get us excited, and she always loves all the fun and over the top action. I can't tell you how often she's run me down the other name of her favourite foods, insisting that I'm the monster that you're fighting. Since we both like the show, I get to share my fandom with my child, and having the time, that time to share is fantastic. I know it would re really make my little one's day if you would send a reply to this to her. Thank you for reading and never stop fighting. It's a sign photo, isn't it? Hello again, Chroma Squad. Thank you so much for not being so excited to see the reply you sent. The picture the cast you sent for it is framed on her wall. She won't stop telling everyone about her new friends in Chroma Squad. Thank you again for helping make these special moments. Never stop fighting. You know what? You're welcome. Do you know why you're welcome? Because you are.
75. Okay. That we're gonna do next time. Okay. Yes, cardboard mechanic. <laughs> Lovely. Cardboard mechanic. It's magic, it's not that magic. Except for the whole deck set. Chroma Squad, are you prepared for some gra gravel trouble? Gravel? Sure. There's an issue happening in the area where those new buildings are being constructed. Looks like workers are being attacked by other workers. Attacking each other? That's so weird. Is that a haunted area or something like that? I believe it's not, Michael Patterson. You should take a better look at it. Those work these workers are in danger. We definitely need to pay them a visit. Go now, Crover Squad. As Crover Squad got into the construction site, things started to happen. To happening. Oh, Browns. As walkers. That their meat is flesh is flesh fresh. Zombie episode. Still like zombies. Zombie costumes are hugely discounted, so we just went with that. This time our food won't have time to run away. Attack! Grumble, grumble. <laughs> Soundtrack is just so good.
Five, seven turns. Oh, okay. I didn't get them all at the same time, but... Who are you? The one that disturbs the horde of walkers. We had a chroma squad. This gravel ain't yours, so go back to where you belong. Is that the boss? Is this boss? It just looks like the others. We cannot afford a different <laughs> zombie costume mook. For those extras we had to hire will impact our lunch budget already. It's looking great, everyone. Let's get back to our lines. 
<laughs> By this size, I'll need you like I did to those other workers. <laughs> no size? I hate it when I say these things. I love using our mech. Over the horizon, look, there it is! Ludiverse! <laughs> Each combo six, okay. Bonus two hundred thirty one. <laughs> Dodge Kruger proves this episode. <laughs> you kid, so cool one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we have two new messages. Spam, please consider reading. Hello, lovely superheroes. From Lady Gaga. <laughs> Let me introduce myself. My name is Fred, and I work out a company called TV Neuron. But you can call me Gaga. I like it better. <laughs> I'd like to offer you your, you our service and audience boosting for your squadron esque TV show. Fishing professionals for your competitive prices, but since I'm a fan of your show, I'll let you test my service during the next session. Season three. Great. For the next weeks, so I'll visit your studio to install the audience boost in 9.0. One of our most advanced devices. Don't you worry about it. Equipment installations free fees are on us and it runs on an open source code that you may find if you take a look online. I can even provide you with the URL so you may check it. That's proof that I'm not a scammer, I made a phone call and you have some new fans. If you don't believe me, send us an email or all this stuff. Let's <laughs> see for yourself. Okay, dear con costumer, you electric Trickety bill, trickety bill for us, Mark, to fast you. Yeah, pay it. Please know that full payment of your March bill is required until you do your next contract with you. Portals. Can't believe it's been an hour. 
absolute hour I've been narrative diagnostics is complete completed no issues were found test 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 okay our narrative feature is back on track sorry for messing it up Chrono Squad narrations feature is wholly operational and it still can't spell properly but I guess we're all just going to get to it at this point why do we choose to record an episode on the rooftops when temperatures are high, Benny Schmeller? Because it's better than when it's raining. <laughs> Maybe, let's go. Chroma Squad arrive at the rooftop and some strange portals roll around. This part, what I'm supposed to say? Improvise like this. Don't let them get any closer. We can overrun them. Monsters appear to defend the portal. They just follow Chrome Squad. Looks like we're surrounded, and the only option is fighting our way out. Awesome! The minions are not our only problem, Mook. These things. Portals? To survive, they will need to destroy these portals to keep bringing the monsters to them. Would they be able to do it in time? That answers my question. Thanks, narrator. <laughs> Wait a second, you went in the script. Hmm. Doesn't really matter, I'm here to check if everything is going according to the plan. See you later. Uh, that was weird. What do we do now? Since the portals are destroyed, we can move on to the next scene. Attack! Nah! Oh, you bastard! Press the wrong button. 
bollocks. This is what I wanted to do. Schmeller needs help. Attack! Now we are. Attack, yes. She fuck it. We did it though, we did it. The Chroma Squad saves the day once again. But wait a minute. Where did these portals come from? And where did that monster come from? I could spend all day just beating up those new minions instead of destroying the portals. The portals are a nice addition to the episode, I guess. But what about that tiger? No idea, costume was too good for <laughs> to be someone from Dr. Soap Studio. <laughs> you got that right, Samuel Chuff Art. Well, at least we recorded a fun episode. Hell yeah! But, uh, yeah, we got. <laughs> Silver linings, yes. Well, that's funny, we should definitely watch the latest crafts. I'm having a lot of fun, so dare you. <laughs> this is my second warning. You clearly ignored the first one, be careful. Hi there, Crowder Squad, how are you doing? Quick intro, my name is Chris Shell. I'm a video game programmer and also a super fan 
of Sentai anime Tokusatsu and etc. Etc. What is etc? I believe I have some sort of power that allows me to have great intuition. I might be a superhero, but for now I'm just a game developer. Anyway, I have a feeling this, this that you will soon fight a TV monster and something might go extremely wrong. I know this sounds creepy, but I'd like to stay alert just in case you need some help. I've got some great problems on skills that might come in handy if the worst happens. Free stalker bodyguard? It's a deal. No, I'm not a stalker. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. All I know is I've had this feeling and I want to help you. Thanks for the opportunity. I want to fail you, Cobra Squad. The season finale, the fish and chips. <laughs> that means a known to existing fairy tales and use their lovely voices to charm sailors into the depths of the ocean. Is that true? Crowder Squad will have to figure it out after a strange monster steals all of Cerberus projects. <laughs> so here we are, everyone. Season finale. This is a tough season to make. Running a studio is not easy. I'm sure we'll get better at it. Let's do the best we can. Severo's alarm is sounded again and beef Chrome Squad's devices. Something is happening, definitely. <laughs> I started to like the rather unique grammar of our elevator system. To Severo's chambers now. In such a hurry, they teleport as fast as they can. A few moments ago. Here again. Here we are. Everyone be careful, we can't break it. Remember our boss wants it in one piece. Help! We're under attack! Rover Squad, you're right on time as always. <laughs> Whoa, security breaches happened. I'm glad you're here. Show these villains the true power of friendship. Get into the boo powers unleash. Multi shots. Give up! 
looks like they're going down. There we go. Yes, sir, bro. The monster called Fishman stole all our research, all my research products, and escaped. We need to locate to recover my data before it is used for evil. Can they still don't see a forget? They thought as much, Mook. As you can imagine, I'm not very skilled in handling paperwork. Now they actually managed to download all the data. Can you perform a scan, Sabro? We have no clue where to find her. She seems to be headed to the sea by the docks. <laughs> Move quickly! I sincerely hope they don't go through all my files. <laughs> Any files on there that shouldn't be there, then, Sabro? There she is. Fish bait is running away! But Crem Squad reaches the docks in time! There you are, fish mate! Stop whatever you're doing! Hello, Crem Squad! I see you've heard of me before, huh? Yes, we did! We protect the Earth from, from you at all costs and. Oh, clam up this here and talk from you guys! Love creatures come to my aid. <laughs> what the? What on earth are they? I just need to be near water to refill my energies. We can't let her escape. God's sake. You're not running away from us, fish mate. I don't have the plants now. Plants? Make it paper? Please, we've had this trip for a century. I've totally texted him to my boss already. He's especially pleased by Zebro's De Zombified project. De Zombie what? Turn zombies into regular people. Duh! But why would someone ever want that? All I need to do is reverse it, then we can turn regular people into zombies! The heroes can't hurt me, there's some people, so I'm a master of the the world and stuff! <laughs> Go on, Chrome Squad, we have to go through all these minions to reach her! When you hear my song, you'll fall asleep for an eternity! Not free defeat you first! I've got such an easy catch, Chrome Squad! <laughs> Crab Squad, you need to go through us before. Over our defeat bodies. And in ten moves, what the hell?
<laughs> not fair! <laughs> it's fair enough when it's not raining. What are healers then? So we Shorts. What are you doing, Moo? I got away from me then, I always did. Welcome back. How goes the murder? Wait. It, the crime fighting murder murder goes very well. Now we now have to face fish, mate. Yeah, wobbly ones as well. She's in a bikini. <laughs> Am I right, lads? Finish your move on this bugger. Crown my power. Why are you do that, lady? Why? <laughs> yes, I'm gonna tell I mean, no wonder my guy is thinking me. No wonder my guy's under the influence. Well, it's Michael Patterson under the influence, actually. Oh, 
But again, when you see jit, uh, tits jiggle, are you surprised? How you doing? Too much work on ya. Well, that sucks, but hey, at least you've got about another hour of me here, so you know. Finishing with Vulcan, I could get two up. Oh, now we got to kill these buggers off, I guess. Fine. So we can do this, yes, we can. Off, you Hate the good guys. That's <laughs> gold. Almost finishing time. Yep.
Let's see if we can do it this time. Oh, come on! She's still not there? Fine, we'll do it three times on a... It's like a WrestleMania match. I didn't win in ten turns. I'll show you my true power now. Up when they walk and run. Wish I could be a part of that world. <laughs> Little mermaid. I wish I could be part of that world. I'm pretty sure I've had this one before. Anyway. Ludiverse! <laughs> okay. Six combo. Bollocks missed it. Slimy fish maid has been defeated. Whatever adventures await our heroes, watch the next season to find out. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. Are we famous now? Oops, I'm the last one here. I guess everyone left to grab some food while I was working. Time to take a break. Wait, why am I even talking through the narrator system? Oh, I forgot Gargoyle was coming. He might be here any moment now. A few moments later. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Hi, Gargoyle. How are you doing? Hello, hello, funny schmeller. Are you by yourself? I won't take much of your time. Just need to install your audience booster in your studio. Take your time, I almost forgot you'd come by. And I was gonna say some get some curry rice next door. Come and join. I can't really stay for the food. I just need a moment of your time, lovely. A minute later. All well, set and ready to roll. Now I must go to a meeting. I hope you enjoy your audience boosters effect. I did call her Fally Schmeller, yes. <laughs> We've got Fanny Schmeller, we have Stuart Chuffart, oh, sorry, Samuel Chuffart even, we have Michael Patterson, we have Mook, and we have Crafty Revel. That is our team. 
Willy Wanger and Dick Tingler know. <laughs> that was fast coming today. I said, what is that? Go for the roof. Very well. The honest producer is amazing. Goodbye, money problems. <laughs> oh yeah. Eight hundred and fifty expenses, but income my pounds. New contract for two thousand dollars. Record season finale after five other episodes. Contract will cancel if the number of fans is lower than 20. <laughs> okay, who should we go for this time? Toys fans. M Mobile. <laughs> Let's go for these. I mean, this, this gave me some good shit right here. What's up, Gaga here? <laughs> hey, all, how you doing? Just check to see if everything's fine. Everything fine? Just wanted to show you sh what you show to me sh which as much as you do. Let's make our audience go through the roof. Hello, card lovers. I'm CEO of Knights of Penny Cardboard. Inspired by sorceress of the East Coast. Dang dangers and cardboards. As well as number two, Secret Society of Cardboard Box Admirers. <laughs> <laughs> in all of your masterful display of your clothes on TV show. Would you be interested in becoming members of our cardboard cult? It's a lifetime fee of $32, and you'll get a shipment of assorted cardboard flavours on your mailbox every three months. <sighs> yes, who <laughs> held a cardboard cult? <laughs> So we're getting cardboard, cardboard, and more cardboard. More cardboard than you can shake a stick at. But remember, don't shake your stick at them. They might get angry. This game is fucking amazing. Instantly revives a fallen ally after free time. Oh! Yeah, so don't shake it, shake it for things that are evil. Don't, just don't catch yourself.
Definitely, right, okay. Let's go, let's go start season three. Fred, Fred Gargo and his portal. With the help of Ludiverse Productions, new Fred Gargo, the third season begins with a huge boost in audience and a bigger budget to match. From three team acrobatics and defeat four enemies with a new character. Having a big, bigger budget is so exciting. Now that we can afford it, why don't we do that episode I wrote months ago? I'd love to... Don't joke about zombies and time travel. No way! And the reason we have a bigger budget now is because of our leadership and Gargar's tips. Tips! <laughs> On the mainstream, we need to think bigger now. Hey, Gargar guy is helping us a lot, but Fanny Schmiller, you're not alone. We are a team. We'll talk about this later, right now, as our leader. Fanny, stop it! As if we should start the season with Gargar's idea. The Monster Portal story. We've recorded a Portal episode already. You'll be fine, narrator. Do the talking, please. Our heroes are still searching for the interdimensional portal. A portal they believe to be the source of all monsters invading Earth. Gargar told us that he set up the portal at the forest. Did you buy no new narrator software, Vanish Miller? Some people grew fond of the old one, bad grammar and all. <laughs> we can't have subpar narration anymore, Crafty Revel. Off to the forest! Yeah, Robin. No more subpar na narrations for us. We can't have TC shouting. A few moments later, Ludiverse Productions and their camera crew started recording the episode. Something tells me that a threat is near. It's best for us to stay alert. The threat was nearer than you expected, huh? You're never wrong, Michael Patson, but watch out, there are more! You bastards. Okay. <laughs> Boot powers are rich. I thought they were going to do that. 
heal up thing. Ah. So what do you guys who've seen this so far think of this game? And would you consider playing it yourselves? For justice! Say triple team the bastards. <laughs> nah, you're not fun of the uh, the board sort of. As Jamie pointed out earlier as well, it's very children of zodiacs. Right, after dealing with all minions. Oh, these new minions look great, and I love this set as well. Well, after a minute, it's a big improvement. Silly mortals! Did you think you could reach the monster portal? That's why we've come here. Where is this portal? I'll never tell you. This information is above your access level. Access level? Cut it out. We have left side to record. So you are Gargoyle's friends. I see. All the frogs here are already here. We just need some footage from this place. Later on to the portal thing. You'll have to beat me first. Came from the portal to fight by your side, malevolous plant. Uh, should I say something now? This is very different from script.
That's the helium frogs. your way. The, the music in this is absolutely amazing. stuff I can do here which is good. a real tough level to do. Ooh. 
Ouch. Nothing. Eighty four, <laughs> yeah. Fifty five little gub. <laughs> the portal. <laughs> Trebien, or Trebien, now I'm leafing. I see more minions incoming quickly, or a group before I overrun. We need to deal with them, otherwise we need to jump and swim. Would you really jump in the water and swim away? Bunch of cowards. No, running is never an option for us, as soon as you say it comes first. Script. Don't know the call lines, Fanny Schmeller. And the director's instructions are all about you, too. The lead should be on the best tapes, that's how the same guy works. Fanny Schmeller's right, everyone. Lead centric is a tradition. Please, everyone, don't argue. I should try to have fun like you usually do. See what they're capable of. <laughs> See what you're capable of, Travis Scott. Uh oh. There's some dissension in the ranks. Housing.
<laughs> Let's get him like shit house. Okay, stop hitting us now, bastards. Ah, oh, more frogs, bastards. And that didn't take him down. It's nice for taking away some of them. Oh god. <laughs> power on this one. We have to do something there. Liking the fact that a lot of this Yeah. <laughs> 
Thank God, we've got some at least. And there's more on the way. Nice. The portal was not found, but tomorrow's a new day. Silly helps Chrome the Squad will find it very soon. At least we got some awesome takes. That plant was hitting for real Spanish Mella. Ouch! Is the show becoming real? I've mentioned it, Grover's Squad is great in the show, wouldn't you, Jeans Barry? Yes! Heroes, I'm your biggest fan. I have so many questions for you. What city you guys find again? I never seem to catch any news reports of your exploits. Then again, the big media never comes to your important, important stuff. Did Halliburton design your Becca? <laughs> How do you know what commands activate your powers? Is there some sort of heads up display on your helmet? What the region of the military does Chrome the Squad even work with? Your biggest fan. <laughs> Hello again. One day I want to go out and be just like you. I just like Chrome as well. It's got a non fictional representation of the international crisis. Shock to show it's not public broadcast. Anyway, I'm extremely grateful for you protecting our country from overwhelming threats. to show I'm, in, I'm listening. Fair enough, no worries. I'm glad you are. I'm glad you're enjoying it. That's fine. Okay. Let's go record one more. Has Fanny Schmeller gone too far? <laughs> Mook has a friend or a terrible costume that wants to help out in episodes. <laughs> My friend told me she would she want, would come to record an episode. She is the one with that terrible pigeon costume. I don't think we need her, Mook. We need better crafting monsters. I'm sorry, but I'm not cancelling on her. We may have someone else with a better costume next week. No need to cancel, Rook, but we should listen to Fanny Schmeller and aim for more quality. Suddenly, a samurai-esque figure appears in the recording set. 
Our Ludiverse Productions episode's been recorded here. Yes, but who are you? I am true and only Red Samurai to prepare. Fighting on the samurai side, you say? I guess so. Cool outfit. Oh, I hate that when it does that. That wasn't bad. these buggers out first then. Or Play-Doh, very nice. Friendship! <laughs> Oh, 
Chroma Power! Here we go. Ain't over yet. What? I'm sure I had that name before in a samurai series. My references are so obscure. Well, whoever hired that guy is much better than the terrible pigeon costume. Then the terrible pigeon costume girl arrives at the set. <laughs> so you are a terrible, uh, I mean terrifying pigeon costume girl. Since you're here, let's record already. What's your manners, Fanny Schmeller? She's strong enough to hit you like a truck. Enough, both of you. Let's get to the right set. Let's get to the right set. Come on, everyone. I wonder if I can save this mid episode. There's about a few minutes left. Trembling fear, crab out smart. They can't make hand signs gone too far, Dubs. <laughs> and you'll see that science hasn't gone far enough yet. Minions! Uh, I mean, really? This is not an online forum. Who wrote that? Ooh. A pigeon sound? <laughs> Ouch, there's no need to hit that hard, Fanny Schmeller. I'm sorry, Mook. I'm not paid to get beaten up while this. I swear I didn't mean to hurt anyone. It can't look too fake. Actually, Fanny Schmeller, you have been kind of rude since this gargoyle appeared. Sorry everyone, I'm just trying to make the best show possible. Perfect! <laughs> Boot powers unleashed around, yes! <laughs> My god, hashtag uh, Ludiverse Production Super. <laughs> a great way to finish. That is a great way to finish. Let's read this. Hey, don't delete it. Okay, read this. Right, okay. Uh, hey, this is kind of crazy. But hear me out, okay? I just have to warn you from very trustful source that, uh, that we are 90 percent sure that the monsters you are fighting are real. Hey, you have to believe us. You must write an episode where even is completely nothing defeated. Hey, I know it sounds crazy, but... Hey, but it's true. Also, from less trustworthy sources, I am the only one who believes there's a 50% chance that you are all also part of simulation virtual reality, so I need some sort of video game, you know? Hey, 
Anyway, just in case, do not pull any power cables and may turn everything off so you don't disappear. See whether we can. Can't get any wood yet. <laughs> Let's craft that. <laughs> Do they handle awards for these? The chief of lots. Nothing no sense. Get a big, nice, shiny sword. Well, maybe you get a new gun. Ladies and gentlemen, we've had another two and a half hours of this, and that has been a lot of fun. Let's quit to the title so we can hear the lovely music again. But I want to say thank you very much for being here this week. Thank you very much for being here tonight. It has been a great deal of fun. So, next week on this channel, more of Armed and Dangerous on Sunday morning. Sunday service, episode 299. Tuesday, more Castlevanians. Hopefully, we can get through Bloodlines. I've seen what the last three stages are like, and ooh, bugger. And then, Wednesday, another recording of Formula One, and, uh, and Crashes of Us Monaco. And more of this Thursday. So, hell yeah. So, let's see uh, if anybody is on for the raid. Let's just see, shall we? Let's just see if anybody is on. I mean, we could go pick some pirate uh, who's on right now. He is on. So Geo is on. Pixel Pirates on. J Dub's on because he's going to be playing some. Um, Geo is on. He's going to be playing some more of uh, Tomb Raider, which I like watching. So that's what I'm going to do. We're going to go raid Mr. J Dub. So I will catch you. Podcast is not going to be on this week, I don't think. Uh, because James sadly has uh, COVID, so he's going to be resting. So get well soon, James. Get well very soon, mate. So I will see you guys Sunday here, Sunday morning, at YouTube tomorrow. So have yourselves a good one. Thank you so much for joining. 